Hello, hello, hello. Hope everyone is well. I feel I had a decent night's sleep, but I feel like shit because I had a cheat meal yesterday, and as of today, it's a Sunday for me. So on the Saturday, I had a cheat meal, and I just don't think they're sitting right with me nowadays. <laughs> I, th I think I just overeat. Um, that's obviously a, a mentality thing because of obviously being in a deficit, and the minute you get a chance to have those extra juicy calories, you make the most of it, don't you? It's only natural, it's only human, in it? But it will be controlled. Marvel, stay, let me catch up. But hope everybody's well. Um, today is a back and bicep and a rear tail um, workout today, which I'm looking forward to very much. You know, the mentality of going into a bulk now, it feels nice knowing what I've got. Stay. Day. okay let's go knowing that obviously i'm I, I was on six meals a day when i was cutting and now on a bulk of seven meals so it's going to be you know instead of the two and a half hour three hour gap between each meal it's around about two to two and a half hours um, so that's quite nice to know that i'm not going to be starving as much you're still going to have to hunger but that's when you have to control it because you don't want to overeat and you got blobby but um, yeah, um, my final weight for the cut was, I think I said 173, 174. And today, obviously, because of my cheat meal on that, it ballooned up to 182. So, <laughs> but it will slowly drop down over the coming days. By how much? We'll find out. But as per usual, Marvel, this way. Marvel, down, listen. Um, yeah, be interesting to see where it goes over the next couple of days, as per usual, keep you all up to date. Hope everyone's having a lovely day. And yeah, just having a walk, as per usual, the pre-gym walk. And yeah, let's keep our head down, you know, tunnel vision and that. Oh, fuck that one. Looking like a nice day. Granted, it might only reach about 10 degrees, but looking like a nice fucking day in London. Yeah. Not even a bit of sunshine reflects on some buildings. Opposite the wall, that is the Thames, if anyone wants to know. <laughs> but I'm going to love you and leave you guys for the time being, and I'll speak to you soon. Hope everyone is well. So, into the voiceover of the workout now. Um, first exercise for the back, bicep, and rear delt workout was some um, quote unquote assisted wide grip pull ups. And yeah, so on one of my pull days, I will do a more narrow grip to obviously aim more low down the lats. And then this one will be a wider grip just to hit more of that upper back. Because I feel like after cutting, I need width. I need width on this back, so width we shall get. But second exercise was, this was the exercise, I'll call this exercise of the day. This felt amazing on my lats. And I remember seeing uh, Dexter Jackson, if you know, you know him doing it and look at his back but this felt great so it's almost like doing a v-grip pull down but this was more isolated and what you want to do is have your shoulders protracted so forward and almost just dragging the grip like along the bench i had to like literally sit on something because i was literally dragging it across the bench and it was fucking up the headrest bit but yeah just drag these down towards the belly button and these felt lovely. Like, like I said, exercise of the day. My lats were fucking pumped after this one. But I'll tell you what, I think I've got a small head because my fucking headphones keep slipping off. I don't know if you know this, throughout the workout, look, or this set, the headphones have got lower and lower on my fucking head. And it almost fell off. But anyway, third exercise was some classic barbell rows. And I think one thing in this off season slash bulk season, whatever you want to call the fucker, is I'm going to incorporate some more quote unquote old school, more free weight exercises as the body's going to start feeling more replenished and obviously a bit more body fat going to go onto the body and the joints are going to be a bit more better off. Yeah, definitely going to incorporate some more because these felt nice. It's been a long time since I've done something like that. Then to some hammer grip rows on a plated machine just to target those traps upper back so 
when the weight's in front of you, like where it is then, have your shoulders protracted now. And then when you pull it, retract those shoulders. Retract them, retract them, and squeeze those upper traps. So I need I need a bit more beef on there. Oh, I just need I just need I just need to be bigger overall. <laughs> That's it. More of a story. But now these felt nice. I haven't done these before. Literally, I haven't. I've never used a neutral slash hammer grip. I've always done an overhand on this machine. So yeah, thought fuck it. Feeling good today. Let's give this a jolly good old go. Good good old go. Fucking old George, you idiot. Then some rear delts, nothing too fancy, just some reverse flyers, keep the shoulders protracted. So we're not trying to pull those shoulder blades back because we don't want to incorporate the upper back. We're trying to keep those shoulder blades forward, slash sh shoulders forward, and just pulling away from the body just to hit those rear delts. Pull away from the body, not just up, but away from the body. And then coming into the last exercise of the day was some one-arm preacher curls. This is probably my go-to favorite bicep exercise. It's a, uh, I get a great pump, you get a good stretch. It's isolated, you get a good squeeze. What else you want from it? And it's a bit, it's an exercise I've swore from day one since ever working out and I'll never get rid of it and I'll, yeah. But I do one bicep exercise every so often and this is the one i might incorporate more bicep exercises as the bulk slash off season goes deeper and deeper but yeah this was nice but i'm just going to throw a bit of a physique update for you guys so just hitting the back double bicep as you do but now filled with carbs a bit of sugar in the body oh it feels nice it's feeling good i feel i feel really good nice i feel nice already merry christmas says the christmas tree on the back but yeah this is what i mean by i need more width very narrow and that is coming to the end of the video i've got some youtube on in the background so this is very off-putting because i'm talking to the camera but i can hear something else on my tablet but yeah that's the end of the video as i said just made all my food for tomorrow meal one meal two meal three meal four meal five meal six meal seven Meal prep is key. But yeah, uh, the pump, oh, oh, coming off the back of a cheap meal yesterday. It felt great. And obviously the bulk has begun. I am so, so excited mentally. Let's speak tomorrow, yeah? Leg day.